Welcome into the Fan Duel. Hurry up. I'm Maria Marino for Fantasy Sports Network, joined by Jim Sonis, our number fire analyst, with week five of the NFL season in the rear view, pretty much. <laughs> We're going to talk about all the players whose stock is rising and whose stock is falling. But first, stock up. And you want to stock up on this player, Joe Mixon of the Bengals, Jim Tell me all about Joe Mixon. He returned from injury and had a pretty good outing yesterday. Yeah, the reports yesterday morning were that Joe Mixon would be on like a snap count, have a limited role, splitting time with Mark Walton, and I panicked. I started to take Mixon out of my lineups, cut down my exposure to him quite a bit, but he wound up having a full workload. It was really good. He played 78% of the snaps of the Bengals, 22 carries, and four targets. Now, the four targets, not as many as the seven he had back in week one when he was healthy, but... They only threw the ball 30 times despite playing from behind most of that game. So I think it was a really solid workload for Joe Mixon. We've seen in the two games and I guess the three games where Mixon has played because uh, the one where he played half the snaps against Baltimore too, they've gotten him the ball early and often 17 carries and then 23 or 21 and then 22. So he's getting the ball both as a receiver and as a rusher. And I love that both from an upside and from a floor perspective. And now he faces the Steelers coming up in week number six. That is a good matchup for running backs. So with Giovanni Bernard still out, looks like he will be out for this week. Again, it doesn't seem like the Bengals trust Mark Walton. They had Thomas Rawls active yesterday, but he did not do anything. I kind of think Joe Mixon is just kind of this, you know, locked in RB1 type guy with both a really good floor and a really good ceiling. And now that we know that the workload is going to be back to where it was before, I honestly have no reservations about plugging him in and paying whatever I need to pay to get him in my lineups. It seems like the only trepidation for week five when it came to Joe Mixon was, you know, would he be back from this injury and be productive and would he be limited? And unfortunately, some reports, I think, made some people um, not be able to take advantage of him. But it looks like moving forward after this week, he is healthy yardage wise. It was a buck 15 on Sunday, plus a touchdown, which equated to about 19 fantasy points on FanDuel. So Joe Mixon's stack is up. 